Hello everyone, La 13 Scale here, also known as Scale, and welcome to Chrono Cross. Just a heads up, I am playing the Radical Dreamers edition on my Switch, and this did originally air on my Twitch channel, which I'll have a link for down in the description below. But enough talking, let's get into the game. Yeah, we got we got the dragon, that's right. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to remember how to... Nope. I, I've been playing Kirby. Like, a lot of Kirby. So I'm trying to, like, remember how to control. I should also turn on my volume. Yes, board my boat, we go to Montanui. Alright, I think also, as we talked about, um... Yes. The adorable little dragon that he is, just hatched. There we go, volume's high enough in my ear. I think, I think that's good, I might have to play with the sound a little bit. Um, there should be more stuff on Marlboro, I think. And especially since we're all demi-humans, uh, I think maybe we'll be looked on more. So next is to go south to the El Nindo Triangle. Okay. I will go there as soon as I hit up the sh shop. Should I be worried about that thing? Hey, are are you are you okay? Are are you okay? Excuse me, sir. Um, didn't expect any visitors in this deserted village. I see. So yeah, this village be gone. That's what it is. I see. I see. What is? What is with the spectral things? Interesting. So this place in this world is not a haven for half-breeds like myself. Demi-humans. Um, I can't remember if there was anything else I needed to buy from this before we go forward, so I'm just going to go to Goldo real quick. Um, you're a smith. I could go to you. I should actually have more iron. Or more, um... Ever since the merchant ships arrived, my shop has been struggling. Why are outsiders so cold to us demi-humans? But in terms of passion of work, I won't lose that anymore. Okay. Um... I just want to make sure that I've got, like, decent weapons, especially if I'm going to have, uh, Draggy with us for at least a little bit, because Draggy makes me really happy. Argent gun. So, before I go, like, super crazy with this, um... Is there anyone that you think that I should, for narrative reasons, take to the El Nindo Triangle? Just out of curiosity. You have Zappa and the Smith Soul thingy. You can check the weapons on the world map or save point. You're right. I can. I figured I was here, so I thought I would. Aw, I gave this guy confidence. See, that's why I did it. It was to give him confidence. Got, um, things. It was to give him things. Okay, glove. No character needed for story. Okay, any character wanted for story? Like, um, the way bringing Nikki made things a little more interesting for uh, being on the ship. Just just so I know before we uh, get there. I'm going to go back to the to the shop real quick and just make sure I got everything I need. Before I go. There will be a boss fight before picking the next character up. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Hi, you. Yeah, I wanted to hit up your shop real quick. Yeah. Let's browse. Uh, I'm trying to remember if there's anything I specifically need out of this. Stores all status effects. We're going to go with a couple of those. El Nindo is just picking up the item for the next recruitment. Got it. 
Um, sorry, I'm just checking to see if there's anything. Okay, there's no traps or anything. I knew I should have bought more traps when I was on the flip side. Thanks, Nightbot. When I was on the flip side, but I just didn't. I don't know why I didn't. Man, if my if my friend Mariah ever gets bored, I'm going to tell her to draw Draggy here because he is just adorable. And also his color palette is something that I think would be fun to work with. Just look at how he runs. I'm sorry. Hold on. I'm just going <laughs> to. That makes me so. Wait, the doctor. I just, I want to see while I'm here. Draggy's idol is flying in place. Oh my gosh, that's cute. Hey, I knew you were listening. Yeah, look at, look at him. Look at this little dragon. Don't you think that would be so fun to draw when like you get to, here, hold on, let me do a, a picture of what he, yeah. Hold on, I'm just gonna, oh, nope, I hit use. I want, like, look at that. I think that can make for some fun things. Send me his name and his photo and I got you. Hey, I appreciate you. I just, I figured it'd be a fun thing to try at some point in time. If anything. But he's just so cute. Uh, medical science has its limits. I do not have the power to save her. Right? Is he not super cute? I stole him. <laughs> he's in the group on the title screen. There, that's true. That is true. Yeah, I'm gonna like, I don't know, get his Wikipedia picture. Hey, who are we saving? We're sorry, we can only allow family members of the patient in the back room. Please understand. Yeah, okay. Definitely, I need to expand my drawings. There you go. Just look at how he jumps. Oh, sorry. Okay, we're gonna go. We'll go. We'll go. We'll go. We're we're going. I just <laughs> I've been playing a lot of cute things lately. I finished recording Little Dragons Cafe for YouTube. I'm literally on the last video to record for Kirby and the Forgotten Land. Okay, before I hit enter, is there anything I should get before I go in here? Any ideas? But yeah, I, I literally have a episode left of Kirby and none of its story. There's just an ultimate cup that I want to do to get um, one last upgrade. Nothing comes to mind. Cool. Works for me. Figured I would just check before we get in. Oh yeah, this isn't going to be horrifying. Just look at how this is framed. Draggy. Okay. I'm I'm worried. Everything that I've seen in Percy Jackson books tells me something's going to pop out of this and try to eat me. Go in. Sure. Sure, buddy. Well, this is beautiful. I also feel like they just reused some ground textures to be honest, but this is very pretty. Please leave me alone. Excuse you? I don't trust that I'm not going to have to fight everything that looks like a fish in here. And hey, we can breathe underwater. Yeah. Is it because we're demi-human? Or is it... Like, is this place just special? Because of all of the three of us, I'd expect uh, Harley to be able to breathe underwater, but... Oh, look at Draggy. Oh, by far the cutest. Like, I'm sorry, Pip. You're adorable. I still have to finish evolving you. Uh, but my point stands. Uh, he he hello? Hello? He oh, no. Get, 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 get. I do not want to deal with you. Thank you. Hey, Mithril. Perfect. It's what I need more of. I need copious amounts of it. Oh, jeez. Move. Second screen has the thing we want. And another mithril. Got it. Eh. Eh. No. No. 
No. No. No, that actually jump scared me. <laughs> I, I didn't, like, say anything, but... Oh, boy. Thanks, Nightbot. But the beef, I did not. That did not settle with me. I have to... Schoolmates A and schoolmates B? You're insane. Genuinely. Oh! And you're not very friendly. Just so we're clear. You know what? You know what's great against fish? A whole pack of rabid cats. Maybe not rabid. A pack of cats. Yeah. Go kitties, go. Oh, my kitty left. I guess he took my advice. Ow. Time to feed the cat horde? Yes. All right, Draggy. Let's see how cute you are in action, because this is the first time we're actually going to see you fight, so... No! Oh, whoa. That was a one. That hit for so much. Draggy, what are you? You... Uh, Adorable little thing. What are you? <laughs> what is this? What am I looking at? Cough drop. Single enemy cough up a little breath of fire. Wait, I mean, yeah, he's a dragon, but... Uh, you know, I figured his strength as a dragon would have been magic. Well, draconian to be precise. Oh. That was decent. That was, like, super decent, actually. I think I have more questions than I do answers at this point. Um, oh! Well, yeah, I could have done that the whole time, but... No, that's all enemies. Where's the one that's just a guy? Oh, I, I don't think I've pulled it up yet. Eh. We'll go with the photon bean. For literally no other reason than because I want to. That's just kind of how I'm feeling. And I left my door open with the AC on. Okay. And we're all just cool with the fact we can breathe underwater. Cool. Cool works. Works for me. Cool. Great. Cool. Why are there so many of you? Why are you here? Ugh. Can't I just, like, technically fight you all at one time and just save myself the hour? Oh, there's two puffs, I see. Well, time to feed the cat horde again. And... Oh, I need one more. Thank you. Kitties. Here you go, kitties. Enjoy your meal. Have fun. Uh, just be careful, though. Sometimes they're poisonous. There we go. Much better. Uh, I'm just going to have you use some base attacks, because the insanity that comes out of your base attack is an experience. Um, ow. Not very nice of you. Just so we're clear. Literally, that was all it took. That was that was all. Okay. Yep, we're healing everybody. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna get them all, huh? We're all gonna have this big old fight. It's fine. I guess I could use the items. Just go for as many things that attack multiple people all at the same time. Always for the better. Ow. Again, not very nice of you. Okay. Get the feral cats back in. More din din. I'm sure by the time that I'm done with this game, you guys are going to be sick of me using like the same six moves over and over again. 
Ooh. I just kind of cuddled up a little bit in like the the shirt that I'm wearing. Because it kind of looks like a hoodie, but actually this is a t-shirt. And I'm like, could fall asleep levels of comfy. And it's literally all of this hoodie. Which, by the way, is from the movie Coco. All right, Draggy. You beautiful little beast, you. Oh. Oh. I really like Draggy. <laughs> He's great. Kid can stay dead. I'll take Draggy. If we can give Draggy a move that lets him steal from people, I'd be all in. It's okay, guys. I knew this was happening. Okay, I need to see, like, literally any other move. Besides the, the cat one for just a little bit. Like, please. Oh, you know what? I could literally just use Hell Soul. I really could. I don't know why I didn't think of that. But I didn't. No. Don't go after him. He didn't do anything. Alright, I should have enough for a meteor shower, right? Yeah. I wanted to use that a little more than the kitties. Just to mix up the images you guys are seeing. Yeah. Okay, Draggy. Oh, you're fatigued? You poor thing. There we go. I knew that was going to happen. All right, Draggy. You're up again. You got this. I believe in you. Whoa. You outlasted the little man. I don't know how to process that. Hey. I also like that he has bug wings, by the way. Instead of, like, what you would think of as dragon wings. Last one, guys. I was not very good at evading. Not by any stretch. Oh, there's three of these ones. Well, at least I'm getting scales, I think. Uh, please don't. Thank you. Okay. Uh, one more. And now we go back for the kitties. So I've been re-watching, like, a whole bunch of Static Shock lately. Just for, like, my mental state anymore. And I've, like, thoroughly been enjoying myself, but also realizing, like, the show was a lot more woke than I would have initially thought. Ooh. Oh, I was hoping you'd be dead. No, don't hit him. That wasn't nice. Yep, we're gonna do the moonbeams. Like, it, there's things that I definitely knew about, but there were, like, new things? Is, is that an Edgar? Does she want to... Are you playing music? What is... What is... Why? I'm confused. I think Edgar's confused, too. Oh, uh, okay. I see. Do you, do you want to bring her into the frame? Because she's clearly broken over there. I, yeah, she's mesmerized by the ceiling fan. No, no, no. <laughs> she's going to go for that. She's going to want your help getting it. The, the pull cord, by the way, on the fan. She likes to play with them. She needs to make sure her feet are secured. 
How else is she going to be able to grab it? Oh, now you got her attention. Hold on, I'm sorry. This is way more... This is... This is... Because <laughs> I'm usually the one. <laughs> yep, welcome to the problem. <laughs> Imagine when she does that and she's standing on your back. And now, now she's going to follow you out. Yep. Okay, sorry. He was holding her up to the fan because she likes to play with the pull cords on the fans. And, um... And she, she got stuck because she does that sometimes when she grabs. But she and I will stand downstairs and she'll stand on like my shoulder or my back and she'll like reach up on two, two legs and like grab the, the pull cord as well. And she also gets stuck when we do that. So I just, you know. It's a little easier to note some of the things that were covered in static with some of the stuff that's happened in the last couple of years. Yeah. It really is. Like... I was, because there's, there's an episode where they go to Africa, right? And they deal with a superhero who is 100% inspired by Anasi, the, the, like, the, the trickster god that also is the one that weaves all the tales of stories and is represented with a spider. So, like, you see that. But what totally blew me away was like how much more of an accurate depiction of Africa they had. Cause like they bothered to include skyscrapers. There there are skyscrapers in Ghana. Like Star Fragment. Ooh. Um but yeah there's there's eh. there's skyscrapers there. In fact it's like Becoming a booming center of commerce is like at different previous rural places in Africa. Like you turn around and like leave for like maybe a year and you come back and like a whole new area is just popped up out of nowhere. That item is needed for the next character. Okay. Whoop. I don't want to fight any more fish. I already fought my fair share. Don't need any more. Thank you. More mithril. I could always use more mithril. I just don't want to fight any more fish. Okay. This was the door. What's up there with those fish? Ugh. I'm going to just stand by the door real quick. Please swim away. Um... Okay, never mind. You're just going to get super close and bother me then. I have all the things now? Okay, cool. Uh, it's fine. Um, but yeah, I have, I have a few friends. I have one friend that I used to know better. Like, it's, it's been some years, right? And she used to live at the base of Mount Kilimanjaro. And she took the time to, like, tell me more about... Like, what the place actually looks like, and I was sure to mention to them, like, hey, it's not, like, first off, I'm, I'm an American, but secondly, everything that I know about Africa I've seen through a television screen, so, like, you know, and she goes, no, I, I get it. She goes, the more time I spend with Americans, the more I understand it, and I'm like, oh, thank God, okay. I'm I'm glad cuz I barely do and I'm an American. But so yeah, there was that episode of Static. Obviously there was um the episode called Jimmy that is probably the one everyone remembers. When they think of Static and then there was the one that stuck with me when I was little was the one that talked about microaggressions. Did not know you started stream Twitch was doing great with the notifications as usual. It's okay, Earth. That's that's why I figured I'd just throw that out there in in uh, Discord. Ah, just just for good measure. And it's fine. I ended up being a little late on the start too. 
Oh, no, we need Draggy for this. Um, because literally my makeup exploded on my face and it took me longer to deal with literally all of that. So if you see any like blackness around the bottom of my eye, that's why. I think they got away with some of the more serious stuff they did because it was about a black teen. Yeah, I'd, I'd have to agree with that. I really do. That and I think that there was like, well, so it's, it's that. And also they couldn't, you can't quite stray away. Kind of like how Fresh Prince covered some of the same things. Yeah. Um, I think it's that. And I think it also has to do with the fact that Static, uh, the comic that it's based on, actually. Uh, it's fine. I'll get into another fight. So, uh, Static Shock is actually based on the comic Static. And this is uh, issue number one from the 1993 run. And one of the things that Milestone Comics was super well known for was not really beating around the bush regarding uh, the black experience. And then Milestone got bought up by DC and then they kind of went away. And now Milestone is coming back. And they're even releasing a whole new uh, run of Static Comics as well. To go with that idea. Especially like now in a 2022 world. Um, but yeah, as, as part of that, a lot of what you see in, in Static really does come from the original comics. With the exception of like, you remember his best friend, Richie? Richie is not in the comics. Richie was made up exclusively for the TV show. And so was, like, Rubber Band Man. Uh, Puff is in the comics, though. And so is Hot Streak. I think Ebon is, too, but... I do not fully remember, in part because also I don't have the last... I'm missing several of the comics from the 93 to 97 run. And if you, like, were to look them up on Amazon, the last one alone is $1,500 ungraded. So, you know, you can let that settle as a thought. Okay, we are not out of the boat. So the next area to go to is Sky Dragon Isle. Got it. What are you? Because you're pretty. Oh, you're Water Dragon Isle, right? Everyone there is dying. Uh, I think it's up north. I'm just checking around. Thank you. Um, Earth. And obviously Goldove, so this is it, I think. Yeah. Thank you. I like the boat just fits perfectly in that. Anyone I should have for this, by the way? Main thing is the boss fight, so you'll want to save before entering. Okay. Alright, I did equip that. In which case, I'm gonna... I already did, actually. I auto-saved. The boss uses Ultra Nova, which is one of the trappable elements. Oh, okay. Do I have it? The ability to to trap that. Uh -huh. What color is it? It was Ultra Nova. And let's see. And keep going. Keep going. Um, I don't have it. I don't think. Up oh, there it is. 
I have two. Well. Here we go. Uh, um, let's see. There was something I wanted to equip. Yeah. Put it there for now. Actually, I'll just do that. Just in case. Because I know we're going to come up on stuff later. I just don't have anything else in the spot. Um, hi guys. Thanks everyone so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you liked what you saw here today. And be sure to hit that notification bell so that you get notified when I'm playing more Chrono Cross. Take care everybody.